in this corner, we got the DK Oldies Dreamcast. And on this side, we got the Facebook Marketplace Dreamcast. We've all purchased games from websites such as eBay, Macari, DK Oldies. We're extremely excited to get it. And then it arrived on your doorstep. The insert was ripped, the CD was scratched to hell, and oh, there's nothing worse than a yellowed console. At this point, you felt scammed, right? But were you scammed? Really? A website like DK Oldies doesn't have any pictures of the actual item that you're purchasing. They're way overpriced. I personally, myself, would never in a million years buy anything from DK Oldie. Well, that is until now. Oh my god. What did I do? Let's get the DK Oldies one open first. And this is the first thing that I want to point out, and I knew this when I purchased it, and it's freaking ridiculous. A third-party controller, $190. A third-party controller. And we're definitely gonna have to test that thumbstick later on. I mean, for the most part, the controller looks pretty clean. It's probably because it's never seen any use. They do include, this does, it does look like a adapter that would have came with the Dreamcast. I can't tell if this is like some third party thing. It's been a long time since I've actually had a Dreamcast. And it came with AV cables, which obviously it's, they're brand new. So these are, <laughs> these are definitely not the original Dreamcast cables. System and game startup. Oh, thank you. You gave me uh, uh, some directions as though I don't know how to turn on a Dreamcast. Oh my God. <laughs> that is yellowed as Oh my, I'm gonna have to pull a rich here. I gotta rub my head. I mean, at least the open works. Yeah, the power button seems to be working. It's not sticking, so that's a plus. I mean, there are some scratches there. I mean, overall, it's not too beat up. Oh, look. It's a seal of quality. The console itself is in pretty decent condition, minus the yellowing, no box. A third party controller, $190. <sighs> Next, let's get into the Facebook Marketplace. It's an official controller, but it's disgusting. It really needs to be cleaned up. And here's the cable, which this looks official. It looks like a cable that the Dreamcast would have came with.
Well, it's fairly dirty. It looks a little more dirty than it did in the picture when I was looking at the listing. It, it's pretty, pretty disgusting. The buttons aren't sticking. The door opens fairly well. I'd rather see this dirty Dreamcast than a yellowed one. At least I can clean this up a little bit. The only bad thing about this one is it, it didn't come with any AV cables. And the buttons feel all right on the controller. <clears throat> Nothing a little elbow grease can't solve. Honestly, it's already looking better just from what? A few minutes of me scrubbing really hard. Controller's already looking less disgusting. Well, that's one clean $80 Dreamcast. All right, moment of truth. Power button. Power light. We have a working Dreamcast, ladies and gentlemen. Does that mean text read error? Ooh, you heard that? No, it's not making the sound now. DK Oldies, you s hundred and ninety dollars and a faulty controller port. You heard that? You gotta wiggle it just for it to work. Idea. Uh -huh. DK Oldies is a freaking scam. Well, not quite. I just think that they're overcharging. It's not really worth $190. It didn't even come with a damn box, DK Oldies. The Facebook Marketplace Dreamcast was dirty, but I was able to clean it up. And if you don't count shipping and taxes, I only paid 80 bucks for that. Now I gotta go and find out how I could mod this to hopefully bring the price of it up 
so I could at least break even and get my money back. So if you have any suggestions on what mods I should do to this Dreamcast, let me know in the comments down below. All the links to the products that I use to produce these videos are linked down below in the description as well as social. So please connect with us. I'd like to talk to you other places than just YouTube. But as for now, I'll see you in the next one. Hey guys, instead of staring at my ugly mug, why don't you go ahead and check out one of our other videos? One, two, I'll wait. My busted face ain't going nowhere. We'll